bastard. Also a bastard. What the fuck you waiting for? It was this one day in February. It was a shit day. Like today. I come to my home after I drive all day long. And I park at the front of my house. But not on my side of street. I have to park on the other side of street because Milos Milos who lives next door to me is a fucking drunk. <laughs> he drink all the time at the toy factory where they make the cotton candy for the fat American baby children. <sighs> So he drink at work and then he drive home and smash up a fucking car. I say to him, stop this Milos Milos. He says, mind your own goddamn business. And that is why I park on the other side of street. So I go to my house, but the door is not locked. I think my house has been robbed. <gasps> but it is not robbed. <sighs> Everything is where it should be. <sighs> and the lights are on, which is also very strange because I not paid the gas bill last month. I think like my father once said, Life is short, you can be cold for a minute, you shut up! <gasps> there is a smell of bacon. Which also very strange, because I don't eat the pig meats. in my house cooking this bacon. If you are a cook bacon in my good pan, I will cut your face and I will make you ugly if you are a woman. If you are a man, I will kill you where you are standing. Only blonde women. She say, hey there, Mr. Sailor Man. Which I do not like, because I am not a sailor. I drive a cab and you shut your face. It is expression where I come from. I do not care where you are come from. You get the fuck out of my house. And take you bacon, you pig meats. I am upset with you because you have not brought the pins. I say, what are you talk about? You are some woman I, I don't know. My name is Tina. 
Which is strange, cause in my country, the word Tina, it means a battle of a pig. <laughs> You promised me beans, you son of bitch! Get me my fucking beans! You are crazy! If we had the police in my neighborhood, I would call this police and have to beat you like a woman in the streets! You get me beans, or I burn down your house while you sleeping! Oh woman! If I get you beans, you must leave my house and take you pig meats and my good pen with you. Because if you leave that pen, I will chase you down and put grease in your hair like you do to a woman. <laughs> I say, what the fuck, the woman, you take your clothes off. I tell her, you put your clothes back on. I am a good Catholic man. You shut your face. We have all the beans. And she say, you get these American beans. I like a beans with no ketchup on it. You stupid! <laughs> uh, my house is still smell like a pig meat. Where is this goddamn woman who hit me on the head with pig meats? <laughs> Crazy woman, I will not eat pig meats. All nurses to the nurse station. You eat the pig meats or I cutting off your balls with your good knife. I'm very surprised she not this my good knife. So I worry some more. Who is this woman to know so much about me? Group 305. So I say. Okay, you crazy bitch! And that is the way that I know I actually like pig meats. I like them so much! And now I eat the pig meat all the time! Still, I don't know who this woman is. <sighs> she leave me, and I get free next morning when they try to rob my house. Because the fucking door still is open. But it is as they say, the best thing about being from Eastern Europe is that one day you will die, and then it will be over. What the fuck you waiting for?